Welcome back to another video. I hope you're having an amazing day. Today we're going to be opening up a Pokemon Elite Trainer Box that I actually found on sale at Walmart. And it's very sus. It's very wrapped. It's wrapped very sus like. Like look at this. Normally ETBs aren't wrapped this badly. So we will see. But I actually got it on sale for $40. 40 dollars 40 40 right here we got it on sale we're gonna see why it was on sale and we're gonna see if we can actually pull anything decent from this since it was on sale and then i also have a booster bundle with six booster packs that we will also be opening but before we get into that hello my name is josh pokestep i hope you're having an amazing day and i say let's get into it so like I said, we've got this Scarlet and Violet base set Elite Trainer Box, and it had this sticker at Walmart. Limited time only, $40. Not entirely sure why it was on sale, but look how it's wrapped. Like typically, they aren't really wrapped this poorly, and I bought it because it was on sale. And we've also got the Scarlet and Violet booster bundle that we will be opening with it as well. And I will actually open this first, I think, just so we can get into the Elite Trainer Box. But like I said, I do hope you're having an amazing day and we're gonna see what we can get. Um, I hope you had a good, I know this video comes out like the week after, like almost two weeks after New Year's. Um, I hope you had a good New Year's. I hope you had a good Christmas and everything. Looking forward to 2024, seeing what Pokemon cards we can open, what packs we can get. I would love to buy some, not necessarily vintage, but older packs I want to be able to open up this year. Um, that would be very fun. And then I want to do more vloggy styled videos this year. I did recently upload one where I let my three year old Owen actually pick out some cards that I opened up. Um, it was a fun video, very difficult to do with a three year old. Um, if you have a three year old, I do not recommend. It was still fun. I had fun doing it, but I do want to do more stuff like that. And then my wife, Sarah, and I were actually talking about some video ideas that we're going to try to do. And are you kidding me? The first pack, a gold Coridon and a Spidops EX. Dude, the first pack and we get a gold card. Are you kidding me? I can't remember if I need this one or if I need the Maridon. I don't remember. Oh my gosh, let's go. Striking gold with the very first pack. That is insane. Oh my goodness, let's go. What a good first pack for the opening. That wasn't even the Elite Trainer Box. That was the Booster Bundle. And I've honestly had some pretty bad luck with the Booster Bundles. So the fact that we pulled that from the first pack was mind blowing. We got Ralts, Tandem Mouse, we got Pokegear 3.0, Floet, Team Star Grunt, we got Lucario, Rock Chestplate, we got Vavillain, Satitan, and a Reverum. Reverum. Um, so we are getting closer and closer to Powdan Fates. Literally only a few weeks away. It does come out at the end of January, the end of January 2024. I think it's like the 23rd third i think i could be wrong i will have the actual release date pop up on screen right here below me um either way i'm definitely looking forward to it i want to i want to get some shining fates and open those up again because that was such a fun as i throw my pack that was such a fun set to open um i i do like the shiny sets like hidden fates Shining Fates, Haldean Fates, all of the sh the Fates packs, you know, <laughs> all of those. I do love them. Um, I would love to open up Hidden Fates again. It's been a long time since I've opened, like a, a year or so since mm, a year. Yeah, probably. I'd say a 
close to a year since I've opened up Hidden Fates, and they're just getting more and more expensive. Um, I didn't, I haven't opened a ton of Hidden Fates. I've opened tens. I think I've opened like six tens, I believe, from Hidden Fates, and I've opened up two Elite Trainer boxes, and that's about all I've opened from Hidden Fates, to be honest. Um, I kind of got back into the hobby as Hidden Fates was ending. I, uh, when I started collecting cards and stuff again, it was like right as Champion's Path was coming out or right after maybe, I think it was like right after Champion's Path came out. Cause once I got Champion's Path, Vivid Voltage came out. And I remember being able to find that very easily cause that's about when I got back into it. And if I remember correctly, Vivid Voltage actually came out on my birthday. I do not remember the year, but I will have that date pop up as well, just so I can see. So honestly, we didn't get a ton from that, but we got a gold card. Like honestly, that made that booster bundle well worth it just from that gold Coridon EX. Let's get into this $40 Elite Trainer box that I bought from Walmart. As you can see, the wrapping on it, is this double wrapped? It's double wrapped. That is crazy. Like, look at this. So I take off this plastic wrap and then it has the actual plastic wrap that the like distribution center put on it. That is so weird. It's a little damaged down here. We'll see if anything's wrong with it. I don't think anything would necessarily be wrong with it. Maybe they're just trying to move the product off of the shelves. I don't know. At that specific Walmart, we will see. It looks like it has everything in there we will see for sure we've got the packs we've got the damage counters we got the dividers we've got the promo card we all love a good promo we'll set that over there we've got the code card take that let me know what you get okay and then we've got the packs we'll set this right down here on the floor we've got two four six eight nine so we have all the packs so that is a good sign i'm just assuming that walmart put their own like plastic wrap on it so they could instead of putting that 40 dollars sticker on the etb itself i don't really know why they did that but that's just what i'm assuming that they just individually wrapped it themselves we got pokey gear 3.0 floet palmy we got Satitan, flaffy Youngster, we got Coridon, shop it in a cloth. I am still trying to complete Scarlet and Violet. There's like 17, 18 cards that I need for this set. Hopefully we can pull some that I need. We will definitely see. Here is a code card, one to the front. Let's go fire energy. Look at that, we got fire. Houndoom, ooh, I love Houndoom. Fido, we got Scatterbug, Drifloon, Vitality Band, Toxtricity, Crocolore, we got Hound Hour, Muck, and a Miriam Full Art. Let's go. I think I need this one. I definitely think I need this one. Let's go. Such a good card. I love the Miriam Full Art. And I do actually, I have pulled the alternate art Miriam Full Art. I actually pulled that one from the Target Black Friday tins. And there that video is actually here on the channel. If you missed that, definitely go back, check it out. It was a fun video. Got quite ooh, do we have something back there? We got quite a few good pulls from those tins. Mastiff, we got Blissey, Jock, we got Florigato, we got Rocky Helmet, Weasel. Oh, okay. That that back card it got me i thought we had something but we don't it's okay we got that miriam though that's a good one here we go moving right along but 
now that, while I have you here, I would love some suggestions. Maybe if there's something you would love to see me do a video on, whether it's opening products or going out finding products, just let me know down below in the comments what you would want to see from me this year. Ooh, a Grievard. I think I need this one too. <laughs> Let's go. Look at the Grievard. Oh, it's so good. I think I need that one, honestly. Let's go. This ETB, not bad. Like, not bad at all. Let's go. Um, What was I saying? Oh, yeah. If there's anything you want to see from me this year, I would love any kind of suggestions down below. Maybe some constructive criticism, you know? If there's something that I might, might need to improve on my videos, let me know. I am reading comments. I'm replying to them. I am taking them all in letting i just i want to hear from you guys what do you want to see what do you want me to improve on let me know because i do want to make these videos as entertaining and as informative as possible because that's why we're all here you know we're here for pokemon we're here for the fun of it and i just want to have fun with you guys we got satoddle magikarp magnemite energy switch we got the villain Doxbun, Torkoal, Flittle, we got Skiddo, and an Arbeliva. Let's go. I cannot Arbeliva. I pulled that Miriam and Grievard from the Sealy Trainer Box. See what I did there? Arbeliva, Believe, Believa. I, I don't know. Sometimes I just say things thinking it's funny, and it's not really funny, but I try. And then it's just weird. <laughs> we got Metacham, Quaxwell, XP Share. We got Grimer, Mezagoza, and a River Room. We have two packs left. Let's see if we can get anything from these remaining two packs. Here we go. Ooh, my packs are falling on the ground. There's a code card. One to the front. Guess it with me. I'm going to go Psychic. Ooh, we got Fighting. Vroom, Clauncher, we got Skiddo, Quaxley, Scovillain, Oinkalone, Breloom, Annihilate, we got Saviper, and a Dondozo. We have one pack, and what I do on the last pack of every video is what I call the double pack blessing. Trademark, copyright, I own that. You can't steal it. I don't really have it copyrighted, but you can use it if you want. I give you full permission. Um, what's the double pack blessing? You take this flap right here, and you go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and then, hum, hum. That is what I call the double pack blessing. And now that I have doubly blessed the pack, we are guaranteed, guaranteed to pull something amazing. Is that true? Absolutely not. It's what I like to tell myself to make myself feel better about it. We got Ralt, Tandem Mouse, Pokey Gear 3.0, Vitality Band, Toxtricity, Mouse Old, Capsa Kid. Chansey and a Halucha. So as you can see, it did not work, but honestly not, honestly not bad. We've got the Grievard, which I do know I need. Uh, that right there looks like he ripped the head off of a stuffed animal, but I don't think that is the case. We got the Miriam, which I'm pretty sure I needed as well. And of course the gold Coridon EX. Let's go. And we got a Spidops EX, which I know I have, but either way, honestly, not a bad opening. I was definitely kind of weary with that Elite Trainer Box. So if you see those at Walmart, I would definitely grab them because it is like, what, $10 off or so. So grab them and open them and have fun with it. And thank you so much for watching this video. I do upload three days a week. I upload every Tuesday, Thursday, and Saturday. So be sure to give this video a thumbs up, subscribe with notifications on that way you never miss a single video. And I am actually on the road to 1000 subscribers. So once you click the subscribe button, the screen's gonna change colors. It's gonna spin in circles. I'm going to get dizzy. You're going to get dizzy. We're going to have a great time together. There's going to be DJ music playing. We're just going to have a dance party and we're going to, we're just going to get down. You know, we're going to have fun doing it. And once I get to a thousand subscribers, I plan on doing some sort of giveaway. And with that being said, keep being amazing. 
keep being awesome, the world is a better place with you in it, click on the two videos over there. Don't forget to subscribe and I will see you in the next video. Have an amazing day.